going on everybody z here welcome to a new series a new server all of the new things guys we've done it so we had a minecraft series before we had a minecraft server before we're playing on there things got a little out of hand so we started a new minecraft server got some new things in in place new you know world guard regions all the fun stuff and uh, we're back. We're starting a survival series. Here we go. So without further ado, if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Now, I'm going to do a super quick run through of the spawn area. So that way, if you guys do join the server, I'll have information on how to join the server down below. It is not a, like a free public server. It's a kind of like a, a Patreon supporter kind of server. So um, information down below. If you guys are curious, you want to join in on the server fun. But uh, yeah, pretty much, here we go. Z1 Craft Server, this is it. Um, now, you're gonna notice probably immediately this area right here. If you could tell me what that area looks like, leave a comment down below. I'm curious, do you know? Do you know it? <laughs> I feel like you probably do. So uh, let's go ahead and start with this area over here. Super quick run through um, because I am survival mode and we're doing survival things. This is the biomes area. Now in the last server, all we did oh yeah look at that we got spaceships on landing pads right here uh we kind of tried to theme some things uh this area right here is kind of no man's sky-esque you can see we have like little decorative deals and stuff like that anyways a lot of cool stuff I'm not gonna go over everything you guys can check it out if you want to um but in the last server we pretty much just had it like open and uh, the, the spawn was just made by people playing well we decided that we are going to make the spawn it's still a work in progress and we're gonna get things kind of started and then give people options to expand. So all the, the all of these biomes, uh, you have your Mesa biome here, right? Well, guess what? You can warp Mesa. So you wanna build in the Mesa area, guess what? Whoop! Now you're in a Mesa biome. It's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. That way we gave people options. They can go out, they can do what they want to. If they wanna build in a certain biome type um, that we have listed here, they can now we don't have uh we don't have like a glacier or spikes ice spikes biome or anything like that but uh we have a lot of the the basic ones i figured if you're wanting those kind of things then you're gonna have to go out and find them yourself anyways all of these work um i think we have what mesa taiga snowy tiger mega taiga snowy taiga jungle and actually that jungle's a bamboo jungle so it's actually pretty handy we'll probably stop in there to grab some goodies um and then we have a swamp area in case you want to do some swamp things we have a desert and what is that one over there savannah i think savannah yeah and then of course back here this is kind of our nether hub region so we'll pop into the nether hub real fast like so you guys can see now things are under construction still but we want to get it to a point where we can get it out there and have people start enjoying it as quick as possible so let me go ahead and whoop warp on in here okay this takes forever when you're not in creative mode <laughs> uh this is our nether hub check it out we got some we got some lava monster tentacles coming out of the ground. This is a work in progress. Obviously, you can't go in here. There's no way to do anything. But uh, this is our little nether hub. And the idea here is essentially when people start building their uh, nether portals, this is going to be like the central location. If they want to connect everything to it, they can. Boom. You have a giant gateway. Fantastic. Looks great. Has It's amazing stuff. Absolutely amazing things. Uh, and that over there takes us to a racetrack. We have a gigantic, gigantic ice boat racetrack on the server now so um we had one before but it wasn't as big this one's massive still under construction as well but it is functional and ready for a little bit of racing so if you guys are interested in that um okay and then what else do we have this was the biome area that's what we got over here so if you guys want to check out uh do some things you can build your base any of the biomes and yeah tell your friends hey go to this biome do the things do the stuff uh that right there is the uh the no man's sky trade platform kind of thing that's what we have over there there's a squid ship on it oh you see that look at that squid ship it's a squid ship um i did make these ships so they're not fantastically amazing but hey it's a thing nonetheless uh and then everything over here is kind of a work in progress still not a whole lot we just have some rocks uh we have this sweet little caterpillar deal over there doing its thing i'm also trying to keep an eye on my food and my health and stuff like that because we do have uh, we are in survival. Actually, I wonder if in the in the spawn area you're good. I don't know. Anyways, you'll notice there were some signs that says, hey, start over here if you're new. And over here in the little astro habitats, uh, server staff here. Look at that. It has all of us. Oh my gosh, we're all naked. <laughs> uh, admins and mods, mods, things like that. People that helped us out with uh, getting everything here. 
server rules very basic server rules just boop, right there you get to go make sure you read them so you know what you're supposed to do and what you're not supposed to do over here we have um armor stands books so if you guys want armor stands boop, click the book get your armor stand i'm not an armor stand kind of person but they're cool nonetheless uh we have a little bit of a region land claim tutorial right here fantastic this is going to be what protects your guys' bases and spawns and stuff like that from uh, getting griefed by other players because that was an issue we ran into the last server. And then we also have chest locking, all of that fun stuff. Um, yeah, everything's written right there to, you know, get into. Uh, what do we have here? Basic commands. This is where you're going to go. You can see all your basic commands. You got balance. You got message. Spawn. Set home. Delete home. That's right. You can set your home. So if you're lost, you can just warp home. It's super amazing. It's a quality of life thing. I know. Um, but you'll notice that I did say balance. That's because we are using a diamond. We're using diamonds as our balance thing on the server. So basically what you do is you go to the bank. I'll show you the bank over there. You deposit a diamond. You sell a diamond and you get a hundred, I guess, Z bucks. I guess we're calling them Z bucks here. hundred Z bucks. <laughs> Um, you'll get 100 Z-Bucks. Fantastic. Now, if for some reason you have money and you, you don't have diamonds, you want to withdraw, they cost you 120 to take out. That way you don't just like, you know, constantly switch them back and forth. You'll have to think about your decision before you make it because it takes 120 to get it out. Anyways, um, and then we have shops. That's why the balances are there. So we, people have people can have shops and make shops and we have a whole area dedicated for shops. Super easy to make. Um, I'll probably go into those later. Or if you guys have questions, just uh, hit us up on the the discord or uh in game whatever but i'll i'll probably try to make a little little thing about how we uh how we have our shops and stuff working so look at those all fantastic i know right um over here we have a train station so say you don't want to take a biome you don't want to do that you want to you want to go somewhere uh closer to the spawn well you can however the spawn is actually protected out for like uh, i think it's like 500 blocks in each direction just so nobody can build right next to the spawn and we can expand as needed. Uh, this is the train station. This will all be fixed by the time the server goes live anyways. So let's talk about that. The server goes live, right? The server goes live on the first. The first is when we will begin whitelisting people to join the server. So if you guys are interested, um, if you're already part of the server, we already have a list of current uh, supporters over on Patreon or on Twitch. So don't worry, you guys will be uh, auto whitelisted. Well, not auto whitelisted, we'll have to do it, but um, here's the bank. This is where you're going to go to sell your diamonds. You're going to just, you know, click on here and buy a diamond for 120. Nah, I'm going to sell one for hundred and that'll give you a hundred. It's fantastic. I know. Right. Oh, uh, I got to clear my funds out. Okay. So anyways, my funds are not nine, 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 nine. So I need to, I need to clear that balance out because that'll, that'll ruin things. I will be playing in survival mode. Everybody on the server will be playing in survival mode unless we are working on the spawn or we're working in areas like this that are going to be community areas. So we're not having any even, you know, moderators, admins, things like that. They're not building their bases in creative mode because that's just not fair to everybody. However, we have to be able to have that ability to do things. How come there's no Minecraft music? Like, I don't understand what's going on here. Anyways, down here is the mall. That's right. We have a mall, guys. Guys, we have a mall. So basically how this is going to work, my shop's right here. Um, you're going to go up to a shop. It's like, hey, I want this shop. You got to tell somebody. Let let one of the moderators know. Uh, Lavix, Techie, myself. And all of these are region claimed. So just let us know. Hey, I want shop 21. We will make sure that you get assigned to shop 21. And then boom, you can set up your shop in here. Do your things. Sell your items. We have 75 shops in this mall right now currently. 75 some of them are claimed you'll see on the sign like that's uh gracie shop um this one's unclaimed unclaimed uh let's see who, uh, who, uh, who else do we got here we got emerald shop there but um yeah this is gonna be how the mall works elevator down whoop so you can go down here ouch good times but yeah there's uh we got we got some shops we got some things fantastic all right cool now, I think that basically covers like a super quick rundown. Again, if you guys want more information, just hop on the server. There's people here to help you. There's signs everywhere. I think we got it. It's it's fairly, it's fairly easy. It's, it's pretty darn easy. Also, just so you guys know, this right here, this is the shops uh, plugin. So um, when you guys want to sell items, you're going to see a interface like this. It's not going to be command driven. You're not going to have to type commands. It's all going to be interface driven. Um, but again, we'll get into that later because you bet I'm going to set up a shop. I got to make some money. Got to make some money. But uh, let's see, what else do we have? Oh, 
over here we have a gigantic ice boat track absolutely massive i am not going to cover it right now because it is massive it is just a monstrosity so if you guys are into some ice boat racing we got that oh yes we do indeed and then actually probably one of my favorite games that we have we have a mini game over here let me get over here so we can show you this mini game all right so right here we have spleef we have spleef it is a fantastic little pvp area uh don't mind me don't mind me anyways what spleef is normally you have a shovel you try to knock out the blocks from each other boom you fall down fantastic good time oh whoop I lost the game. Fantastic. <laughs> Super easy game. Anybody can play, uh, but we do recommend, you know, shovels. Uh, diamond shovel is like a kind of an instant break thing. But once you're done or you want to play another game, guess what? Boop. Um, okay, that's broken. We'll fix that. <laughs> that's that's, uh, that's a, the wrong. Yeah, that's at the wrong coordinates. That's not good. Anyways, that'll be fixed by the time anybody gets on the server. Any hoozles, <laughs> but yes, spleef, it is working. Oh, <gasps> look at these Astroneer trees. Isn't this Astroneer landscape absolutely beautiful? I'm telling you, it looks great. It absolutely looks great. What is this? Horse? I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, let's get on with the survival series, shall we? I already have a place picked out that I'm going to run through uh, my little area that I want to build in. Uh, this is region claim, so people can't just hop in hop on hey look it's mrs z hi mrs z <laughs> all right so let's do it let's exit the spawn now like i said there are protected lanes there's the spawn area which we're in and then there's the protected lands the protected lands run like i said about four or five hundred blocks out you'll see a little notification in your chat bar once you exit the protected lands but we are about to exit spawn oh you also notice the sky the sky's black because we wanted like a space theme in here uh so kind of kind of over here but as soon as i leave we will get blue skies yay all right now we are officially in the game which means uh, i'm not gonna i'm not gonna collect stuff right here and we go back over to my base area so let's see my base area is like over yonder oh gosh guys <laughs> this is terrible <laughs> i have to dig oh no i actually have to do stuff we've been playing in creative uh get everything set up so it's going to be a little, little interesting getting back into the survival type things. All right. So I'm going to head over here. I know where my little area is at. But I have a rough idea of where I want to go. Hey, look at new recipes unlocked. Wonderful. Absolutely fantastic. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, we're getting close. Now, I wanted my area kind of close to spawn-ish, but not too close because I don't want to uh, uh, ruin spawn by having my stuff absolutely everywhere. Why is there no music? Hello, chickens. How are you? Are you guys having a good one? Fantastic. Looks great. Um, okay. So. Hmm. How have I not got any hunger down yet? Weird. I'll have to make sure we don't have a setting messed up for that. Because I don't want to be cheating. I don't want to be cheating. <laughs> All right. Yeah, this is the area. Okay, cool. So, I picked this area over here. It has like a little, uh... Kind of a neat little area i guess you could say it's like a what is it i think it's extreme hills or something so i do have to be careful when it comes to digging because i don't want to get hit like destroyed by silverfish but i have a plan for the most part and my base is going to be over here oh gosh this is kind of hilly we're gonna have to fix all this oh i'm so excited to do all the things so excited so my base is gonna be mainly right here in this area build a little bridge across from here all that wonderful stuff fantastic looks good feels good but let's go ahead let's start harvesting some trees getting some wood getting some things going that's what we need to do here hello sheep how are you i need to get some sheep we need to get some farms going we need to get all of the basic things going all right we got some stone we got some no we didn't get stone we got wood we got some wood all right let's go ahead and build ourselves a crafting table yay okay cool now uh let's just yeah we're gonna place this guy down so we can make some things and some stuff Make some sticks. Oh, uh, make another set of sticks. Why not? Wonderful. Go into here. Let's do one of those guys. And uh, do I want a shovel right now? I don't think so. I think we're good. I think we're good. Let's get some stone though. We need the cobblestones to do the cobbly stone stuff. I need to make a quarry area too. 
we're gonna try doing i'm gonna try doing super basic things right now you know the the basic episode one kind of stuffs but um my idea is to try to get like a mine area and whatnot it's already kind of kind of like planned out let's see let's get a cobblestone pickaxe let's do a cobblestone axe and a shovel why not might as well all right feels good oh it feels good to be playing minecraft again it's been a while it has been a while i don't know why it's been so long but it has been uh okay so i'm gonna grab some of this stuff some of this wood stuff here and then we're gonna go start building our little base area all right we got a little bit of wood here now i'm gonna make my way up here to this area and see what we are working with now i think there's a lava pit in this area if i'm not mistaken as well like right in the center it's kind of why i liked it i was like this looks like a perfect little town area so i wanted to build a town area right here and i think right lava right here yes it is all right cool so um i think we're gonna start the house right here for the most part now i could yeah i'll probably take out some of this dirt we're gonna be we're gonna use dirt we're gonna use all that fun stuff all the beginner tools all of that <laughs> um all right so that looks good now let's go ahead and make a few of these i want to keep a little bit of raw wood though so we can have uh some fire making materials in case i don't have any oh i mean there's there's coal right there so we should be good for the most part all right we're gonna start we're gonna start with our super basic house <laughs> it's the most basic of houses uh all right let's see looks good and yeah I, I think i'm gonna mark out my house i think i'm gonna mark out a little little rough rough design for now all right there we go i wanted to make it like a not squared shape because if i if i made it a square shape it would be a square shape forever now now it won't be a square shape it'll be a not square shape you know what i'm probably gonna use all of my wood by doing this though probably will that's fine we need we need you gotta have a good foundation for a good home am i right absolutely all right well that wood did not go very far at all oh uh we definitely need to make stairs going from this area to this area because this is gonna be an absolute pain if i have to walk up the side of that mountain every single time all right foundation has been laid <gasps> very nice now i'm kind of looking at the shape and i'm trying to figure out what i'm gonna do with anything now this right here actually looks perfect for a couple double doors a little double door thing and we can make a little staircase leading right down there you know so that'll actually be perfect for that so of course i need to go through and make this a little bit taller because a good foundation's not going to protect me from absolutely anything once it comes nighttime all right it's coming together coming together nicely um i think we should be protected for the most part not super worried about it but we do need a couple of doors so i think it might be time to make uh what another set of sticks and oh where's our craft table did i leave it down there or i left it down there that's fine we'll just make another one we're gonna need so many craft tables it's gonna hurt um okay now how does the door go is it this way and that way this way this way that way no must be the other way all right, what what is your secrets, door? What are you? Oh, it's just those now. Oh, maybe it's always been that way. I, you know, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, so we'll set those there. And then, oh, my axe broke too. That's right. So let's go ahead and make some more sticks. And then, uh, boop, perfect, wonderful, fantastic. Uh, we can go ahead and throw like a front door in like right where's a good front door like right here actually it's probably perfect Ta -da! we have a front door <gasps> wonderful absolutely wonderful all right cool now uh next thing let's see we have lava i mean we could use lava for smelting if we need to but that's not what we're doing we need to figure out an area for our my hey look at some llamas hello llamas how are you <gasps> i don't want you to spit on me i'm sorry i looked at you don't hurt me uh oh Oh, oh, we already have like a little teeny tiny cave here. I hear some sounds. It's a little scary. Not gonna lie. Mainly because I don't have a pickaxe. I don't have torches. 
down there. I don't know. I don't want to go down there yet. I'm not ready. He's not ready. <laughs> uh, ooh, this is kind of a cool area too. Let's check out this area. I'm looking around. I haven't like fully looked at everything in this area yet. So... Just a little, uh, little hole kind of thing there. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, there is more coal like everywhere. I think we should just mine up the coal that's on the ground. Ooh. I'll take this. All right, so we got some coal. And I'm just trying to think because we got to figure out where we're going to put the grand mine. Because we have to have like, you know, the super mine. The big, the big mine that's going to be like my mine. I'm thinking it's going to go over here. It might be this island because there's a lot of gravel here, which I'm going to want gravel anyways later on for concrete. But I think we could place it on top of this area and then build our bridge across from here. And then this could be like a little dedicated mining area. Um, how big is this area? Oh, yeah, it's plenty big. Oh, yeah, this is way big enough. Okay, cool. So we'll do that. I'm thinking we're going to throw the entrance. Let's see. We need to have like a an entrance. And I think I want to have it go down back this way underneath of this stuff because I don't want to get out to the spawn. So I think it's going to be like right over here. Uh, let's take our shovel. And let's just start a little mine. <laughs> and it's already broken. <laughs> Absolutely wonderful. All right. Uh, I think we're going to have to go with the dirt bridge for now, too. So we'll throw a little dirt bridge across from here. Uh, you know, all temporary things. And we'll get ourselves... Uh, <laughs> we'll get ourselves a mine started, I guess. There! Look at that bridge! <gasps> Isn't it a wonderful dirt bridge? It's it's beautiful. Let's let's stay back. Let, oh, look at that, guys. He's done it. My God, he's he's done it, people. He's built a dirt bridge across the across the thing. Fantastic. And I fell in the water hole. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> That's embarrassing. All right. So we got that. We got that. Um, we're gonna start having a little mining area. Let's see. Um, I need more wood. Actually, I need a chest. I think we're gonna need to get some chests made here. So let's get uh, two of these guys made and we'll throw those right there for now. Um, and then this chest is locked as well. Awesome, awesome. And then I think we're gonna do two more and we'll throw these over by the mine. Over what the heck? What is this? What? Oh, is this the land claim thing? This is the golden shovel thing. Oh, that's so funny. So, um, we're, we're actually still kind of working out the golden shovel thing to make sure that it does what it's supposed to, but it looks like... It looks like it does. I'm not, I'm myself am not going to need to use the golden shovel because I have this whole area world guarded. However, the golden shovel, it looks like it kind of marks it out. That way you know what's covered and it's supposed to kind of like expand with you as you go. So that's kind of neat. And then you just, oh, uh oh, I didn't mean to do that. You just touch it and it like, they, they just, they just go away. Uh, the chest is not protected considering a golden shovel. Okay, so cool. That's kind of neat. I like it. So it kind of shows you where you are. Now they don't stay forever. So don't think that, oh, I got some golden blocks because they're mine. They don't, they just go away. Hmm, neato. All right, anyway, <laughs> any hoozles. Uh, that's good, that's good. We need to get some iron. We need to get mining, we really do. But we are getting a little, uh, a little short on time. So I'm just gonna go ahead. I'm gonna end the episode there. Thank you guys for coming out. Hopefully you've enjoyed. I know we did the, you know, showed off the server a little bit, but we got into this stuff. Now by the next episode, all of the bugs should be fixed. Um, like I said, I think we're going to do Minecraft Mondays. So every Monday, hopefully we'll have a video. Uh, but all of the bugs should be fixed because this server is going to go live as of the first, which I believe at the time I've released this video is going to be tomorrow. So if you guys are interested, links down below, how to get access, all that fun stuff. It's going to be a good time. It's going to be fun. I can't wait to have all the people going, all the people in here, all the shops going. It's going to be an absolute blast. But like I said, we're still working out some final bugs. Uh, but I just want to make sure that, you know, we get something out there because we gotta, you gotta have something to play, you know, but, uh, yes, thank you guys for coming out. Hopefully you enjoyed again. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, all the fun stuff, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!